Ever wondered why music flats and sharps feel like a game of musical Sudoku? Well, we're here to decode that for you. Imagine them as the secret spices that add zest to the melody soup. So buckle up, because we're about to dive into the world of musical hieroglyphics. Let's start with the flats. Keep in mind, bad eggs always do great cooking. Fries. B flat is like the troublesome one always causing a little chaos in the music. E flat is the one that brings a unique touch to the melody. A flat, D flat, and G flat are like the main elements in our music, adding depth and taste. C flat and F flat finish the sequence, just like good cooking and fries complete a meal. The sequence of flats is crucial for understanding and making lovely music. So remember, bad eggs always do great cooking fries, and you'll always remember the sequence of flats. Moving on to sharps, think of it as fat cats go down alleys eating birds. Now don't worry, no cats or birds were harmed in the making of this mnemonic. Each initial letter stands for the notes F, C, G, D, A, E, B. This is the sequence of sharps as they appear in a key signature. It's like a ladder. Each step takes you higher, adding another sharp. Knowing this order is essential, like knowing the alphabet before writing a novel. It's the foundation of harmony. It dictates how notes relate to each other. It's like a secret language unlocking the magic of music. So there you have it. Fat cats go down alleys eating birds and you've mastered the order of sharps. Remember our catchy mnemonics, bad eggs always do great cooking fries for flats and fat cats go down alleys eating birds for sharps. These will always keep you in tune. Remember, bad eggs always do great cooking fries and fat cats go down alleys eating birds. And you'll never be flat or sharp in the wrong place again.